Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today's video is going to be really interesting because it's about video generation. As we talk about video generation, we cannot leave out AI video generation. Yes, AI video generation has become widely competitive. You don't need a whole team to work on your ideas for it to look amazing. From Google to ByteDance to OpenAI, every major tech player is racing to dominate this space. In this video, I will break down four of the most advanced AI video tools and tell you which one actually delivers the most value based on the claims on the internet. Before getting into the video, make sure to subscribe to our channel. Let's start with the newest kid on the block, CDance 1.0 from ByteDance. This AI tool turns simple texts or images into 5 second video clips and the most impressive part is its multi-shot storytelling. Instead of static scenes, you get a flowing sequence where motion, character design and scene transitions feel smooth and cohesive. It ranks number one across multiple benchmark tests for both text to video and image to video, especially for its prompt accuracy and short consistency. The only disadvantage that said it currently does not include sound. So while visually it's top tier, it might lack on including the sound part. Now let's skip on to next video generation tool that is Sora by OpenAI. Yes, this was a game changer when it first launched. What are you saying? Is it not now? Let's see. Sora generates long form video clips up to a minute with cinematic camera movements, good depth of field and to an extent human like character behavior. Its strength is set to lie in scene complexity. You can have underwater shots, drone style flyovers and emotionally expressive moments. But the prompt interpretation isn't always precise. It can drift from what you ask for and doesn't support inbuilt sound either. Then comes the third AI generation tool, VO3. Arguably the most complete experience if you are looking for an out of the box cinematic output. What sets VO apart is its built-in audio support. It can create background sounds and ambient noises to match your visual. It handles realistic environments really well and understands narrative flow, tone and scene rhythm as it is claimed. But it's also said to have the least access right now, sadly. It's still being rolled out through Google's video effects waitlist. And while the results are polished, it's said to be slower to render than the others. The final tool is Kling 2.1. It is less globally known, but technically very strong. What is its edge? Realistic human motion. You'll often see it's used for dance clips, walking sequences, or even facial reactions, things that need lifelike body dynamics. It's also fast, so if you need quick results for short form content or social media snippets, this could be your pick. But it is set to be a little bit weaker in narrative depth and style versatility. Think of it more as a performance tool than a storytelling engine. That's all for today. So which tool do you think is the best AI video generation tool for your style of videos? Tell us in the comments below and make sure to hit the subscribe button and click on the bell icon for interesting videos like these.